Glitter, it's shiny, sparkly, eye-catching, and it never ever comes off of you. This simple shiny substance has captured our attention for longer than you may realize. Today we are asking why are people obsessed with glitter? What is now the symbol of glitz and glamour began far back in human history. Glittering materials have always been used in artwork and cosmetics. The word glitter comes from an Old Norse word, glitra. Early civilizations would make glittering material from rocks like mica, hematite, or malachite, or organic sources like beetle shells and fish scales. The stuff we know as glitter was first created in 1934 when a machinist in New Jersey named Henry Rushman created a machine that would cut plastic polymer sheets into minuscule pieces. Rushman then founded Meadowbrook Inventions, which still manufactures glitter today. Rushman said of his invention, glitter's applications are limitless. In plastics, glitter is molded into a myriad of products and displays. Rushman's dream of a glittery future would have to wait a few decades while the country recovered from the Great Depression and World War II. Glitter saw a massive boom beginning in the late 1960s going all the way up to today. Glitter became synonymous with the glam rock musical movement of the late 1970s and became a big trend in cosmetics and all kinds in the 1980s. Today, glitter is everywhere. Speaking of glitter getting everywhere, beards, armpits, hair, butts. In the internet era, glitter has become one of the many weapons in a prankster arsenal. Glitter bombing is the act of covering an unsuspecting victim in glitter. Glitter bombing has been used as a protesting tactic too. You can also create your own glitter bomb to go off in your target's face for magical humiliation. So what's your favorite way to use glitter? Let us know in the comments and what we should cover next. Like and subscribe for more of What's Trending.